Greetings and welcome back to Idle Heroes. Alright, first thing I want to do is I want to jump into the campaign because I am stuck here at 14.4. I want to get over to 14.5. Maybe we'll do that encounter there too. So let's just do this and hope that uh, we're not running into any problems. Alright, um, yeah, why don't we just go with that one? Okay. Okay, Moltis is stunned, but... Uh... Kill him! Good. Okay, and we got another outfit there. That's good. Okay, uh, pr pretty much what we expect there, right? Pretty much what we expect. All right, and start moving. Okay, where else is hiding over there? Okay. All right, so let's uh, go on back. Okay, so in our last episode, um, we uh, ranked up uh, Aiden. Just I can look at Aiden there. Um, yeah, I have been trying to avoid doing that because I was saving up in the hopes of getting something. And But, you know, I was planning on ranking up Aiden anyway, so it was just an attempt to expedite the situation. Of course, it didn't actually help us because we're still dying in here the Tower of Oblivion. But, uh, you know, you can never tell with randomness what's going to happen in the future, you know? And sometimes you just have to make calls, and sometimes you might have a little twinge of regret regarding that. What am I talking about? Well, you know, the old summoning circle came up with the, uh, the free call there. You know, I'm saving up the heroic scrolls for the next time they have the event that, um, that uh, you know has a better chance of getting um, the, uh, the 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 five stars, but of course they do give you a free summon you know every once in a while. And well, my free summon came up, and um, hey, I got another blood blade. So if I trash the other Aiden, the one star one, I still need two others. And as you can look around, you can see I'm not really close to anything. No, I'm not. I'm not really close to anything. So, it's going to be a while. It's going to be a while. I do have him, and I have his unique, but it's going to be a while. Hopefully, that event that um, has all of the, um, the the free star, the, the, the uh, what's the name of it, the uh, better chance to get five stars comes up fairly soon. Yeah, that's... Uh, Unfortunate, unfortunate. Not a lot you can do about that, though. Like I said, you know, random miss, you, you never know. It, it came up in just that free summon. It could have been anything. Could have been the little dwarf, you know. But it wasn't. It was him. But, you know, at least I have him now. I have him so that, you know, when I do get them, you know, happens, you know. All right, so let's take a quick trip over here. Oh, um, I got the, I got two of those gem guys going. What I did here is I have the, um, oh, actually I can upgrade these guys a little bit more. Okay, I have the attack one. I'm just gonna upgrade him a little bit here. Okay, I need to increase the watchtower from there. So I'm getting an extra 10% attack there. Do I have any, okay, what am I getting here? Um, hit points. So I think health and attack is really kind of the what you should do. I do not have enough to do him. No, I do not. Um, any any chests lying around? Oh, we got one. We got one. All right. Oh, okay. Well, it's one, but one is is better than none, right? All right. And what's this? Didn't I just open that one? Okay. You're just going to keep giving them to me? That would be nice. All right. They're popping around all over the place. I took care of the boss there not too long ago. And uh, every once in a while, I'll hit one of these guys. Like, why can't we do this one? It's only got five. I need those little, like, stones there. That's the thing about it is. And remember, you can always go back and do it again. It depends on the daffodils, right? In this case, those guys were kind of easy. All right, we got some more of those. Yeah, just got to keep bumping them out. Just got to keep bumping them out. And, uh, yeah, now I got to upgrade the tower there, right? Okay, so let's... Uh it's going back. I don't know if that, that seemed to be the right idea, going with the health and then going with the attack. I doubt it's going to help me back in there, but you know what? Let's just run through it one more time. You never know. Um, 
There are individuals who think I should take out Vesa and put in Ormus. So, you know, I did. I, I cranked him up. I gave him a very nice suit of stuff. So why don't we... Who am I taking out, then? I'm going to take... Ah, Lord Balrog out. You know, I don't know if they've changed him. I don't remember him healing other people. You know, it turns out that Lord Balrog's attack now heals the, the individual with the lowest health in the group. I don't know if it was always like that. I don't remember it like that. All right, I'm going to take out Bloodblade, and we're going to put Ormus in. Like I said, I kind of cranked him up a bit. I should probably put... Yeah, you know what? Why don't we just do this? Because I think I was doing stuff just to check things out. But, you know, he's got more health, so I should probably just do this. I don't know this. I know this isn't going to work, but... Because eh. you know what the problem is? Ormus is going to die really fast. Okay, he got his he got his heal off, I think, but and we're all gonna die. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Oh wow, that he's he's got a slither left. All right, I don't know if Armis made the difference there, or it was just dumb luck, or maybe it was actually the stat stuff we just did on the island there, because I haven't done it since I did that. But uh, yeah, that was uh... okay. We got past this one. I never, I didn't know, I didn't know how I was ever going to do it. And you know what? I, especially given what just happened with Bloodblade, I really don't want to rank up Lord Balrog. He's not worth taking any higher than six stars, from what I understand. And um, it would eliminate the possibility of others over there, too, you know? Okay, well, you know what? He's earned a spot, so why don't we just leave him in there, right? Armus, I mean. All right. And we're moving on. Okay, what do we got? We have a rainbow. Oh, I hate you so much. Um, all right, let's go. Can't possibly be worse than the last one, He's, which I probably shouldn't have said. I mean, these guys just won, so I'm just going to leave it. See, it wasn't actually the damage that was the worst part of that encounter. It was when you actually kill the markets, they poison everybody. And they, th that was what was happening. We were all just dying after the fact. And this is turning ugly, isn't it? Kill him, please! Ah, okay. So, we're going to make some adjustments here. Let me think. I don't know. What code adjustments can I make here? I'm going to leave Lord Balrog in there. I don't think the healer thing is mattering very much, so I'm going to leave Armus in there for a minute. Do I take out Siegfried? Sigmund, pardon me. I was saying Siegfried. Siegfried. Um, and maybe put uh, Bloodblade in there. I suppose. Why don't we try that? I mean, it, it's another one of those encounters where it could be just dumb luck that happens at some point, you know? You win sometimes, you don't win it sometimes. It's You, you get a stun down here, you don't get a stun down there. A silence, you know? All right. They got a lot of firepower on their side, though. And, of course, Armus is frozen, isn't he? Yeah, that's bad. No, no tanks. I shouldn't say no tanks. Okay, kill him, please. He's silenced. Please kill him. Thank you. Okay. We see that was that was randomness there. We had him silenced, so he couldn't he couldn't do his bad stuff to us, right? All right. Uh, okay. Well, uh, Aiden definitely did his job there. He definitely did his job there, and uh, got some healing in there. Yeah, uh, Bloodblade didn't really help much there. I think it was just, again, it was just a randomness. That last silence probably helped a lot. All right, let's uh, move on. I'm sure these encounters will get much easier. Oh, that looks ugly. That looks very similar to what we just saw. Just uglier, because I see they have their own Aiden in there now. Who's 180th? Yeah, okay, that sounds a lot of fair there. A whole lot of fairness going on here.
Silencing. Very good. Those are what? Okay. Yeah, I probably should have left Bloodblade out of there. He's already, he was long dead. Get him again! Okay, all, all five of you, could you beat on him, please? Thank you. All right. Okay, all right. Pretty much those two are trading off sometimes. Aiden and the Metal Mage. Yes, I will always call him the Metal Mage. Because he's in metal. All right, uh, let's see about... Oh... Okay, darkness. Lots and lots of darkness. All right, let's uh, let's fight the darkness. Yeah, I I'm guessing that if we get past this one, the next one's going to be very difficult. Ouch! Lots of petrification going on there, huh? Yeah, my two big guys are both petrified. Isn't that lovely? They're not doing a lot of damage, though, in comparison, though. You know? Yeah, I mean, they, they were definitely annoying us, but they if you looked at it at that time, we, they didn't do a lot of damage. The last couple did a lot of damage there. Yeah, I mean, they, they, they didn't do a lot of damage. They, they left, we had like more than half of our health left after that. All right. Okay, so what's this going to be? Other than we get this nice item here, which I really do need, frankly. Because I think I can give that to somebody. For oh, no. Oh, this one's going to be fun. Uh. Okay, let's go. They're just healing themselves like crap. Oh, this is going to be a nightmare. No way I get this one. Nope. And we didn't get any silences either. Okay, I have no... I'm not even going to bother trying that one again. Because, yeah, like that. There's your problem right there. There's a whole lot of healing going on. A lot more than us. So, yeah, that's, that's going to be ugly. All right, we're just going to... Forget about that one. All right, let's go back to the um, campaign. Get some uh, more stuff here. And, uh, oh, we got we got 15 seconds. So um, I'm not going to be able to get a five-star from pieces here for a while, even though if we win this one, we're going to get 10 more. I think I have 28, so I'll have 38 then, you know, that kind of thing. Another reason why I want the... Uh, um, I just don't understand the current thing, you know, the current um, event where you're supposed to use prophecy orbs, but they don't give you any way of getting them. I think something was broken there, but a prophecy orbs event would have been very nice right now. All right, let's do this. Yeah, let's do that. I have no idea what we're facing here. Okay. Okay, killing them is very good. Yeah, good, okay. Is she a warrior? Because she seemed to be attacking individuals instead of doing group stuff. And I had don't have a problem with that. Yeah, I mean, the, the mages there were the problem. Once you get rid of the mages, she's the single attacking. I mean, she's hitting hard, but, you know, there's, there's six targets there, you know? All right. Yeah, she did a lot of damage. Um, yeah, pretty much Metal Mage and then Aiden. Oh, and then uh, Sigmund also. Not too bad. It's kind of even right there, isn't it? It says that Balrog doesn't do a lot of damage, but he's just up there to take hits. That way it keeps uh, Dragon Slayer alive a little longer. Alrighty, so I am actually going to let him sit there for a while. Uh, I'm actually start moving him up. Just so that I remember that I've actually done it the next time. But, uh, let him move up there. Alright, um, yeah, I didn't get the item from the tower. I was about to equip the item from the tower, but of course I didn't get it. Okay, so, I have no idea about that. I mean, if we had silenced some of those dudes in the tower, you know, but we didn't. We didn't silence any of them. So, I had, that's a lot of healing going on. 
I don't know what we're going to do about that. You know, I might just take all healers out and go full damage because um, we're not going to be able to outlast them. So it would be a matter of killing them as quickly as possible. I'm thinking maybe of putting the, um, uh, the, the female mage in. I don't know. We're going to have to, I'm going to have to think about that. But uh, we're going to have to target our stuff towards priests again because it was like all oh, priests. So, so anything, that's, anything that's good damage against priests would be good. All right, but anyway, we did get past the Margarets, which was really annoying. So we do have that, and we are moving in the campaign. So, yeah, I mean, the thing about it is Bloodblade, you, you can't guess that kind of thing's going to happen. I mean, if I had um, if I had upgraded Lord Balrog to 7, it could very well have been, you know, that guy I would have gotten, and I couldn't link him up. You never know about those things. Hopefully there's an event that comes along pretty soon that helps. Because I'm safe saving up all of my uh, summoning runes and my gems for that when it comes around again. So anyway, thank you very much for your attention. I really appreciate it. And play games, because games are fun. See ya!